20 rozdział, wiersze od 19 do 22. A gdy nastał wieczór owego pierwszego dnia po sabacie i drzwi były zamknięte tam, gdzie uczniowie z bojaźni przed Żydami byli zebrani, przyszedł Jezus, stał po środku i rzekł do nich, pokój wam. A to powiedziawszy, ukazał im ręce i bok. Uradowali się wtedy uczniowie, ujrzawszy Pana. I znowu rzekł do nich Jezus, pokój wam, jak Ojciec mnie posłał, tak i ja was posyłam. A to rzekł, szutknął na nich i powiedział im, weźmijcie Ducha Świętego. This is the Gospel of the Lord. I've been told by Bishop Tool that I should preach very shortly. And so I will preach. You can, you, you can uh, not be wrong, it's pretty short. Will you be faithful in your office? Will you discharge your duties in accordance with the Holy Scriptures and the Confessions of the Lutheran Church and in harmony with the Constitution of this Church? I will, and I ask God to help me. Will you be diligent in your study of the Holy Scriptures and in your use of the means of grace? Will you pray for God's people, nourish them with the Word and Holy Sacraments, and lead them by your own example in faithful service and holy living. I will, and I ask God to help me. Will you give faithful witness in the world, that God's love may be known in all that you do? I will, and I ask God to help me. Will you guide, encourage, and support the ministers and the congregations of this church in their ministries? I will, and I ask God to help me. Almighty God, who has given you the will to do these things, graciously give you the strength and compassion to perform them. Amen. It is your spirit that sustains the church. By the power of the spirit you call, gather, 
enlighten and sanctify the whole church. O oh God, send your Holy Spirit to Paulina and take her in your service as a bishop of your church. Sustain her as a shepherd who tends the flock of Christ with love and gentleness and oversees the ministries of the church with vision and wisdom. Uphold her as a faithful steward of your holy word and life-giving sacraments and a strong sign of reconciliation among all people. Give courage and fortitude to sustain her in this ministry. We ask this through Jesus Christ, your Son, through whom glory and power and honour are yours in your holy church, now and for ever. Amen. Amen. The God of peace, who brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus, the great shepherd of the sheep, by the blood of the eternal covenant, equip with you, with everything good, good, that you may do his will, working in you that which is pleasing in his sight, through Jesus Christ, to whom the glory forever and ever. Receive this cross and wear it as a sign of your calling to serve Christ and his people. Receive this light and the cross you. Carry it as a sign of your calling to shepherd Christ's people, to nourish and protect them. And now you must turn around and we can acclaim you as the new bishop. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, 
remain with you now and forever. Amen. 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 Thank you.